All right, guys, welcome to uh, Borderlands. What's up? Um, finally playing Borderlands Three after buying it like almost two weeks ago and planning to record it almost a week ago. Um, but yeah, we're finally here playing it. I, you can obviously see I've got little bird face on because I've been playing a bit, but I'm not going to be using this character. I haven't gotten too far, I'm only like level 11. Um, Ryan hasn't started the game yet. So here we go, new game. We play on mm -hmm. normal, because we're not pussies. And... We're going to play with cooperation. You can set it so that, um... You know how in like Borderlands 2, you had to, uh... So, you want to hear a story, uh, huh? A tale of adventure across the stars. <laughs> Come, listen to old Marcus. Have I got a story for you? My tale begins here, on this backwater planet called Pandora. Some say it is a wasteland of greed and violence, and it is. But if you've got skills to pay the bills, <laughs> Pandora is full of opportunity! Vault Hunters. They brave the merciless borderlands in search of secret alien treasure. My father told me tales of vault hunting when I was but a little Marcus boy. And now, I tell you. So, you ask, what treasures do the vaults hide? Fame? Wealth? Power? <laughs> or maybe nonsense like charity or family. I don't know. Use your imagination. Whatever the price, a vault hunter must have the determination to seize victory from the jealous hands of fate. Now, my story is about a very special band of vault hunters who have only just started their journey. They are bold and hungry. Maybe old Marcus tells you this story because they remind me of you. Just a little, don't let it go to your head. These new Vault Hunters are answering a siren's call. Her name is Lilith, and she is a hero, savior of Pandora a dozen times over. Lilith is recruiting a team to hunt for a map. A map that leads to vaults all over the galaxy. But she is not the only one. Dark forces have gripped the borderlands. A new threat unlike anything the galaxy has seen before. My story begins right here on Pandora, with our new Vault Hunters, their siren leader, and most importantly, me. Uh... make us money, we would get, uh, demonetized because the music at the beginning of this. Ah, you thought! Is there any way to, like, get this stuff? Yeah, but if we don't need- it doesn't matter. We're not making any money anyway. Oh, uh, uh, oh, it doesn't matter. Once the video is demonetized, it's demonetized. Yeah, I'm playing like you.
either gonna be Flash or uh, Mommy. Those ten stones. Hey, we got a clone of yourself. The joke is, in every Borderlands game, they the last character to get introduced is always labeled as as themselves. Except for on Borderlands 2. Borderlands 2, Zero, the assassin, was labeled as Zero as the. Uh, it said uh, it was Zero. As the as the blah, blah, blah. it was zero as the number. Ah, it's a beautiful day, full of opportunity. So, who's coming? Right, who am I gonna be? Who are you, man? I'm either gonna be Flack or Ma Mozzie. That's who I'm thinking. I'm gonna wait until you pick. Like, I'm thinking Mozzie just cause... I usually play as a girl. And she's pretty cool. But the animal aspects of Flack... I think is really cool. You know what? I'm gonna flip a coin. Alright. Heads, it's Mozzie. Tails, it's Flack. Alright. It's Flack. I didn't say Cortana. Alright. Here, you pick. New Vault Hunter, huh? Name's Marcus. You picked a hell of a time to join the Crimson Raiders. <laughs> Good to see someone survive the attack. I'm Lilith, commander of the Crimson Raiders. Whoa, okay. Those bandits you fought are part of a cult hunting for the Vault Pack. But you and I are gonna find it first. For now, my scout is waiting for you up ahead. Good luck. She spoke inside my mind. Strange. This is your stop, Vault Hunter. Excellent. The hunt begins. Try to stay alive. I'd hate to lose a new customer. <laughs> Somehow, I don't know if it's new, but I don't remember him having a... Um... And welcome to Pandora! Why are you small? Hey, you must be the new recruit. I am a CL4PTP steward bot, but you can just call me General Claptrap of the Crimson Raiders. What's your name? You are allowed to call me Flack until I decide if I'm going to kill you. Thanks. I'll pre-order your tombstone just in case. Now, those jerks who tried to murder you are the children of the vault, a bandit cult who followed their creepy leaders with blind devotion. Which reminds me, if you're going to obey my every second call, you'll need an echo device. The Echo 3. Slightly more powerful than the Echo 2, and twice as expensive. Besides, the Echo 2 had a tiny issue with spontaneous combustion. So they rebranded those as grenades. Now listen up, recruit. Lilith ordered us to take over a Children of the Vault propaganda center. Time to show those culty weirdos that no one messes with the Crimson Raiders. Follow me, recruit, to glory! Uh... Before we wreak our righteous vengeance, you'll need to register your echo at this quick change. Once we defeat the cult, I'll be famous. And when I'm signing autographs, I need you oh, looking sharp while themes. defending me from my legions of fans slash stalkers. Ah, a user agreement. Boring. Don't what the heck? Corporations have our best <laughs> interests at heart. Except Dawn. You got actual computer. Uh, never mind. The 
propaganda center is this way. Wait. It like froze my game. A locked gate? No! This can't be happening! The entire mission is ruined! Think, Claptrap, think! You're brave and powerful, and people always do it uh, Fire! That's oh, it. I'm actually losing home. Recruit, get that gate open! That's an order from your superior <laughs> officer! You can slide in this uh, game, and it's like <coughs> you can slide very far. That's what I'm trying to say. Guys, so there's no health here. Those cultists have been killing crimson raiders left and right. Money. They totally suck skag balls, but I've got a foolproof plan to keep their culty asses. can't do anything until uh -huh. Claptrap stops being an idiot and gets over to this freaking weapons guy. Perfect. Once we complete our mission, Lilith has to promote me to Super General. Did you hear him though? He's like, he'll be super quiet and he's just yelling as he's walking. I'm being super, super quiet. You did Woo! say stealth, right? Uh -huh. And like, uh, it's trying exactly to sneak around. weird if something's not exploding. Now take your gun, recruit. You're gonna need it. These guns, like myself, aren't beholden to their primary function. I can dance and sing. Oh yeah, so the guns in this game now have alternate fire modes if you hit down on the D-pad. Shooting mode. Try it out. Interesting. Follow me, recruit. Yeah. It's pretty sick because then later in the game you get um guns that like you'll get like an electric gun that also has a secondary f function that shoots um like acid too. That is very cool. I'll tuck my way in, become their king. Build another vault. Give your flesh. Take your gun. Watch and learn, recruit. Hello? Anyone there? This is Shem, holy influencer of the children of the vault. What do you want, Crambot? Hello, Bro, is that Wheatley? Maniac. It is I, Claptrap, Slayer of the Destroyer, and Super General of the Crimson Raiders. We have you completely surrounded. Open the gates now, and perhaps we haven't played through Portal Portal Two yet for our channel. What's that? We haven't played through Portal Two for our channel. Wait to do that. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Just not yet. There's a lot of games we gotta play. Yeah, we're gonna be Outlast, and then I think the next game will probably. Like honestly, we're doing like one world per game, per uh, rec recording for um, Mario, and we're I don't you I hope you guys don't expect us to be doing like every single star because that's not happening. We'll probably do all the extra. Yeah, we'll get a lot of them. Like, like. The ones we need to complete the game, basically. Oh my kids! I wish they were born. <laughs> I want to see what your guts look like. Let me into a screw! I am not a damn child. Take the family. Tell my kids I wish they were born. Oh. <laughs> Oh! Jeez. Oh, me 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 oh. Uh -huh. I'm gonna run out of Oh, 
always starts with us saving Claptrap. So see, um, what I was saying before, um, the, uh, what's called, before the, um, cutscene started, the way it works now, I have it set, you know how, like, when we played, um, we used to play, like, Borderlands 2 and stuff, and, uh, yeah. we would get loot, and it would be, like, the first one to get to it gets it. Ow, ow, ow. Uh, yeah. So now the loot's on. Um, we each have our own loot. So whatever loot drops is what we get, not the, the other player. Or it's something like that. It's either so, we wait, get. What, so it for both of us? Yeah, it, I, yeah, we can both take it. Like, I think it's the same items that drop, but there's one for each of us. Instead of like us beating a boss and only one of us getting the epic from it. Yeah. That was really annoying. Yeah. Cause I remember we played through like when we first started the channel we were playing through Borderlands 2 and um I remember for the first time ever beating the um beating Knuckle Dragger at the first beginning of Borderlands uh two. I got yeah. what's called um I got the legendary from or the epic from him that I've never gotten before. Alright, where are we going now? Uh, search for area shield. for shield. Okay. Uh, I think we don't find it in time for Claptrap Village. Eventually it's like, yo idiots, right there. Skill point to unlock. There might be a shield in that special My red chest over there. Uh, red chest. A red chest. Over where? Are you at the red chest? No, I'm um, and I'm putting in my um skill point, which you might want to do too. Red. Oh, did I accidentally sp Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, that's a cool one. Not a red chest, oh, I'm constantly joined by my my skag. Oh, let's go, dude. I constantly have a pet. Wait, did you get one? Oh, I got one when you picked it up. Yeah. Okay. Where was the crate? Um, wait, how do I? I put it in my... Hit select and go to the... Uh, it it should, if you're level 2 at the bottom, it should say hold uh, left trigger. Oh yeah, or left, not left stick. Hold select, but you if you're already there, then yeah. I think I'm on a level... I know, I am a level 2. Yep. 
That's very good. <laughs> From a certain well, distance in the air, you can um, you can do a ground pound. More savage than the beasts. But you got to be pretty, pretty decently up there. Score one for the Crimson Raiders. You and Claptrap secure the area. I'm on my way. Got a shotgun. Shotguns are my new favorite. Like, this game is very heavily, like, they added a lot of shotguns to this game, and I love it. every other Crimson Raider stronghold. So this will have to do for now. So what's your name, Killer? I'm Ryan. I am Flack, and your voice was in my head. Explain yourself. Yeah, about that. Not the weirdest thing you're gonna see on Pandora. But seriously, thanks for answering my call. We might not have the numbers, but with a badass like you, we've got a His fighting chance. Mr. Chu. Welcome to the Crimson Raiders. Door's oh, a dangerous place. That grenade mod will come in handy. You should equip it before uh, we get started. Let me know mod. when you're ready. Uh, I'm equip. Then I'm gonna go ahead and go to... Can I change the name of my pet? Equip. Tool of death. I like it. All right. Hey, I like how it says like a item like score. It's a lot easier just to like More know what kind of is better. Let's see what you got, recruit. Mm -hmm. There's too many of them. We're doomed. We're doomed. There's like, there's like, like five trillion guns in this game, and it kind of gets to. A point where it's kind of annoying because every every character you kill just drops a gun and then your inventory just gets full real quick. So you really gotta just like know when to not pick up a gun. Take this. Yeah. A lot of all you get, a lot of the guns that you get right at the beginning are just shotguns and handguns. Nice fighting, killer. Ah. Ooh, shotgun. All right, we got a foothold. Maybe things are turning Ooh, our way. Shotgun. Come on, killer, you're with me. Let me catch you up. A while back, we found a map. <laughs> I keep looking at things the and then their um their Dream symbols keep true, getting right? stuck on my screen. I didn't realize how big of a target it would make us. We got attacked and the map was lost. I've been looking for it ever since. This way. I was so focused on finding the map, I didn't notice that Pandora was changing. The bandit clans used to just murder each other for fun. Now they're all under one mm -hmm. banner. Mm -hmm. A cult. The children of the vault. <laughs> right. Come 
on, let's take a look around. Their leaders are the Calypso it. twins, and their followers worship them like gods. They're convinced the map will lead them to something Mr. Chu, get out of the way. Vault, and they've been slaughtering anyone who gets in their way. Mr. Chu, heard a rumor oh, yeah. that a bandit clan found an alien artifact in the desert. Could be the map. Oh, wait. Doesn't have like a shield on the gun? Locked. Hmm? That'd be kind of cool. Keep a siren out. Looks like it. Like that uh, Blackbeard. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, they, they, this game has a lot of new stuff that they added to the Borderlands series. Like, one of the big things they work on with the new Borderlands games is like their new guns. There's like, like I just said, there's like one trillion new guns in this game. There's a gun. There's a gun that you can throw out and it becomes like a move a walking gun. What do we have here? Now a lot of people are gonna hate this. The Sun Smasher clan has recovered the sacred vault map! A Borderlands fan. Me and Ryan Me and Ryan have started Borderlands 2 like three times and never completed it. I've just gotten so bored of those. I'm like, I don't know, it's nothing special to me. For this game, for some reason, I'm starting to really enjoy this a lot better than like starting the other one. I feel like um, another thing that's going to be good for us is like, one of the things about playing the old games is fighting over loot. And now that we're going to be getting our own loot, it's just going to be a lot better. Are we gone? Yeah. Um. Uh -huh. Yeah, we said we were going to do long videos for this, right? Uh, doesn't matter. Just because Borderlands kind of a... If, we, if we're going to be it's doing... a long game. Yeah, if we're going to be doing like 30 minute episodes every every time, it's going to take us like 50 episodes to beat this game. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, but we're also recording a lot of series right now. That's true. Editing wise, it's smarter if we just do longer episodes. Lipsos. Find the Sun Smasher War Chief and do whatever it takes to get that map. Seems like you guys got this. Good luck. I'm gonna go hang out in some trash. Okay. Well done if you want to see uh, Borderlands 3 completed. So what are we working with here? You know, for a long this place kind of sucks, but it's yeah. all we got at the moment. Not the first time the Raiders have had to start from scratch. Oh, it's no sanctuary. Hope Ellie gets that Find ship working soon. Find Sun Chief. <clears throat> oh, green gun. Look on this fr the there. refrigerator door. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, no, it's only a white gun. Ah, sucks to suck. Wait, that, was there two guns in there? No, there was just one. Was ah, uh, I just got a white one. Wow, I got unlucky. I'm sure there'll be times where you get like a legendary and I get like a yeah, some ammo. Shoot more, shot markers. It's one of those ones with the shields on the front. Door. What is this? Uh? Explodios. <laughs> New cereal. My vending machine. This is a side mission broken. for Marcus. It's a really easy one. Ah, how am I supposed to profit off this war torn? Yeah, I mean, uh, sell premium weapons to heroic vault hunters such as yourself. Let's fix my vending machine. And by that I mean, you'll fix it. <laughs> Go over here. Damn cycles, always scavenging to make their buzz axes and meat bicycles. You'll need to replace that circuit with something. Hmm. You know, some skags are chock full of electricity. Get me one of their spines. Better get used to doing things like oh. this if you want to survive on Pandora. Oh, I just found another green gun extra gruesome, on the gun. Wait, so you can trade with each other in this game? Yeah, berries. I think you could do it in the other game, so. That was, um, a way... 
That was one of the ways in my old Borderlands account, and Borderlands 2, for my, like, original, like, single-player Siren that I was playing. I had, like, four million dollars just because I played with someone who was had already beaten the game and was on, on, uh, beaten the game on regular mode and true Volt Hunter mode, which is, like, new game plus mode. Right. And they gave me a gun and let me sell it, and it sold for, like, four billion dollars. Level three, baby. Same. Oh. Calm down. Oh, oh, green. Oh, get off. Here's one of those shock skags now. Get it spied. What is this? A siren head? What is that? Uh, they're like hats for. Like when you. You know how you, um, were. Oh! Oh, no, no. You don't mind handling this, Ah, very good. Bring it back to the machine. And be quick about it. Excellent kill, boy. It's for, um. It's, you have to play as a siren, so it, it does nothing for you, but, um... Uh, workhorse, oh, I got a blue shield. Ooh. Nice. Let me spend my point. Dude, I am, like, having fun. Nice. When flak yeah, pets attack on about. enemy, the first melee attack is automatic critical hit that deals increased damage. Let's just raise, um... His damage. <laughs> Alright, um, let's go fix this. Oh, there's a uh, skag pup here. No, it's mine. It's uh, Mr. Chip. Oh, it's red. Uh, I aimed at it. Okay, it red. now install the spy. Well done, Vault Hunter. Now you have access to my vast array of murderous wares in a new convenient location. Can you use this yet? Good hunting! Uh, oh, I got a rare head for that. Uh, yeah, I got a purple siren head. That just means you can't. Oh, purple. Uh, what? What do you mean? Like order of like uh, what, rarity? What kind of rarity? Yeah. Uh, it's like second best, I think. Ooh. Well, um, there's. Oh, be a siren. There's. Yeah, you have to use. But uh, we just got a free one. Go in your inventory and unlock uh, the Marcus head. You can put Marcus's face on your head. You gotta unlock it and then That's come up here awesome. and, and then um, use the uh, the this. thingy. Yeah. yeah. Um. So I think it goes. White's the worst. Wait, how did I unlock it? What? How do you unlock it? You just go to it in your inventory. Like it should just be a picture of a head and then just click on it Did you get it you go to um your inventory and you should see it in your inventory uh, yep and you just click on it basically I'm pretty sure um yeah, so I think you. I don't understand. If it's already in your inventory. Well, I don't know why they. I don't know. Auto. I don't know. I don't know. Cause uh, they sometimes you get um, yeah, ones that you already have. Good. Oh. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I think the order order goes the same as like Fortnite, where worst is like white. The best, second best is green. Right. Then it's blue. Then it's purple. Then it's. Then it's like yellow, but or orange. I forget what it is in this game. But I think there's like a rarity after that. They're like super duper rare. I like to know who I'm working. With. What would that be? I, for, I don't know what it's called. I've never gotten one. I didn't even know they existed until I found out this game was coming out. Probably like. It's something, something like sparkling or something like that. Gold. Yeah. 
But I also could just be completely wrong and... I'm gonna die. I just realized I've been getting all these new guns, but not looking at which one's better than the ones I'm using. Right. Oh, dude, I just headshot you like every bullet. I didn't even know that. Hey, give me a fair shot. Right. So how do you use that? Um, it depends on which one you pick. So in the other games, like there's the different I lists. Did the gun. What? I did the mini gun one. So uh, it's LB. Well, LB? no matter which uh, ability you're using, it's LB. But yeah. But like the way it works now is there's three different like class sets it's kind of like destiny right. if you remember that um uh so like each character has three different special abilities they can they can choose to um like every ability has its own uh skill tree and okay. you can choose which one you want to um, upgrade and use so like I'm using the skag and I have three different yeah. I have So two. I'm hitting LB. Uh you oh, I didn't I don't think you equipped it actually equipped it yet. You gotta go in your inventory uh, or you gotta go into uh the skill tree and I think flip on it and then you put it it puts it into your uh let the family may live your um okay. loadout. The new um the new blackout uh game uh operation came out. It's like a superhero theme called um Dark Dark Divide. And uh -huh. it looked really exciting. Maybe it did something like I was the thing I was excited about was maybe they were gonna do something superhero like like something kind of like supernatural superhero themed to the um the blackout map. Uh. And all it did was basically add this game mode called like super duper heroes or something like that or super mercenary heroes or something like that and it makes it so that every person seems like they're a superhero but it's basically a game mode excuse for getting um double jumping into the game someone help me that would be you good damn boy so uh yeah. So in the new game mode, you have unlimited grab. So like you can you can whiz across the map as fast as possible, but you have unlimited grapples and there's a movement system like um Black Ops 3. Right. Eh. What the way they were like the if you watch the um the trailer for the uh the operation. They make it look like it's gonna be like a full campaign worth of like gameplay. They added the KN94. Uh, do you wanna end it here? Yeah, but uh, there's loot up there, so come with it. Good. Nice to meet you. Hey, thanks. If you hadn't come along, I might be dead. So, 
What are you doing here? <clears throat> Mission for the Crimson Raiders. Kind of topsy. Direct orders from Lilith. Might have to kill you. Might have to kill you. With the Firehawk? Oh man, I used to run with Lilith back in the day. But you know, now I'm a bandit war chief. <laughs> Ghost on some measures. I mean, at least I used to be a war chief. Until, you know, my clan found that stupid alien junk. I warned them not to mess with that crap. But what do they do? They tie me up and they take it to the Calypso Twins. Not cool, bro. Well, we should probably get out of here before the COV come back. So, where are Lilith and the Raiders hanging these days? Former COV propaganda center. Emphasis on form. Now we're talking. Come on, let's get out of here. I'll lead the way, even though I'm totally unarmed. Um, Can't let them know you're afraid and totally defenseless, bro. Bandit life! All right. Yep, so that's where we're, uh, we're going to end it. Follow this dude. Yeah. Right. For you will be a couple days, but for us will be literally in seconds. Peace out, guys.